I, mean, I swear I tried to keep it under 30 minutes. I tried so hard, but I just can't do it. Damn, damn, damn. Tune in. Oh, yeah. I know some of y'all about to start the Goose Summer Challenge next week. Mmm, Moja coming up. Let's do it. I'm with you. Let's do it. Peace. You ready for the show? So, we about to do the morning toast. I'm joined by the lovely ladies, even though I didn't want them to, to participate today. Trying to get their hair out the way. You know how black folks' hair is. Look, look, keep standing up. I, I love her about her hair, right? Now, so we're going to toast our ancestors. If you have some ancestors that you want us to toast, I got one already ready to load. You too. Um, I'm about to go and uh, we're about to drink the water first. You know we got to drink water first. So I got the distilled water for my girls. Leave that alone. Leave that alone. Leave that alone. Leave that alone. See, there you go. Going in and out. All right. Um, so I'm going to give my girls some distilled water. But I got a sample water that I want to pull out. Give me a little bit. Hold on, not yet. Well, y'all can start drinking your water when y'all want. It's the toast that we gotta hold off on. Hold on, Ace. Don't don't cherry, waste that water on cherry, me. Cherry, cherry, cherry. All right. Bring them out. Bring them out. <laughs> oh yeah, my fault. Bring them out. 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 All right, it's time for the daily toast. There you go. All right, here we go. So now, right now, I am testing this water right here. It's called Life Water. Yeah. If you stop at a gas station, you probably have seen it. It's water without a W. Life water. Y'all see the symbols? I know some of y'all in us into symbology is going to look at that and be almost peeing on yourself. But it, it is what it is, right? So it's life water. I wanted to sample this. This is purified water, pH balance, electrolytes for taste. So we're going to sample this water because y'all know I've been sampling water. You know, But you know, part of the Ingoose Sample Challenge for those of you that's taking it. You have to drink you some water every day. Yeah, so we're going to drink this whole thing of water, regardless of how I may like it or dislike it. This is Life Water. You can find it very popular. All right, you know I told y'all it's all about the story. So let's, lead, let's read, read the story of Life Water. Uh-oh, they don't have a story. All right, okay. Oh, my fault. Here it go. So they got art on different ones. This 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 particular artwork is series 1.3 art by Craig and Carl. We exist to advance the sources of creation and creativity. Refresh your mind and restore your body. Life, water, inspiration. They don't tell you what the pH balance is, but so somewhere we're probably around 7.5. Let's see if they got any ingredients on here. Life water, purified water by reverse osmosis, magnesium sulfate, potassium bicarbonate. 
bottled under authority of Pepsi. Uh oh, PepsiCo, PepsiCo. Inc. Y'all know who that is, right? Mm -mm. That's Pepsi. For Pepsi. water quality and yeah, Pepsi. Yeah. So I'm drinking some water by Pepsi. Mm. All right, come on, let's drink up, drink up. I'm drinking up all my water. All right. Ooh, it's got a horrible aftertaste. It's sink water. It's tap water. <laughs> Isn't that funny? Because people going out paying dollars for this, man. Can I, can I take some? Oh, y'all getting, getting the distilled water. This is the only time I can control what y'all drink, so y'all gonna drink distilled water. Y'all want some more distilled water? Yeah, because I drink mine off. Give me a little bit this time. Give me a little bit. That's the, that's the Give me a lot. All right, those that don't know what's going on, we're doing the Daily Toast. So make sure you drink that water with us. Come yeah, on now. Yeah. Come on, get a glass or something. <laughs> All right, now, for those that's going out and buying alkaline, alkaline water, pH balanced water, all you gotta do is add a little baking soda or a little lemon baking juice soda? or some cucumber to your water to alkaline alkalize it to al to get the pH balance right, right? To get you know to up the pH balance. All you gotta do is add so just a little bit of baking soda to your water. Or add a little apple cider vinegar. Or add some um that ambrosia. I mean it's a free commercial, but hey, I had to do it. Cheap, cheap, free commercial, right? But look, this light water, I wouldn't say I wouldn't tell you to go out and buy it. You know what I'm saying? Actually, I will say out of the waters I had, I like the steel. I love the steel. I will continue using the steel. Next for me would be the, uh, what's the one y'all just threw away? The Fiji. Yeah. Then, um, then the one from France. This one is dead last so far. I'm, I'm not, I'm not impressed. Water. Yeah, it's, it, it is tap water. It's heavy on the tongue. Daddy's. I know y'all like, get to the toast. I'm going to get to the toast. Be patient. Be I like patient. tap water. Well, hey, it's plenty of tap water in there that's free. You want some more distilled water? No, tap water. Uh, you have to drink a lot of lots of water. Guess what? Once again, what happens if you don't have water or air? What happened? You die. That's right. You're gonna so die stay water. As a matter of fact, everybody since it's early in the morning, text somebody and tell them stay hydrated. We gotta stay hydrated, right? Black folks, Can we I are suffering from we are suffering from malnutrition, malnutrition and dehydration. I said bring your mouth big enough. <laughs> I'm, I'm almost done. You know I like to finish my bottle of water. This is, you want some more water? Me too. I drink the water. Give me a little bit. Like right this TV. That's enough. <laughs> Give me a lot. Uh, Give her a lot. Like you're I'm going to get mine. Remember, stay hydrated, family. Mm -hmm. This is 33.8 fluent ounces. Life, uh, life water fam, I won't be buying any more of this. This is at the bottom of my list. I thank them for participating. I love the artwork. Now, I, I do love the idea of them having different artists do that because I'm really in support of artists. But that water... I, I did. I don't know. I don't think I like that combination. Then on top of that, when I read that it's from PepsiCo, I, you know, I don't know. Dad, I drink my water all. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Dad, Dad. All right, now, 
We about to do the toast. So I'm gonna do. I'm gonna give y'all. I'm gonna give the kids. I'm gonna give them. Now this is grown folk ambrosia. This is no longer super sweet. So I have to. I have to be. Y'all, y'all need to be mindful of that of these kids' reaction because they drinking the grown folk version of ambrosia. What that mean? This means that it is well aged. Hold on. Or, um, it's well aged. Ancestors. We sure do. We gotta toast our ancestors. All right. So first, first you gotta lift it up. Lift your glass. You gotta lift, put it where you can lift your glass up. Don't waste it, Sasha. All right. First, toast the creator by whatever name you choose. Call it creator. I we say. call on and we say I what? Ashe. All right. Now hold on for the whole say because we got some names to say. All right, we're going to toast our, um, we're going to toast our ancestors. I'm going to have a name. Miss Stephanie sent the name in for her father, uh, Mr. Calvin Spratling. So we're going to toast Calvin Spratling. I say. All right, any other names out there? Any other names out there? Oh, wait, hold on. Hold on. You here. We got, I got all the names that you're going to say. All right. Anybody else? Make sure you send them in. All right. Um, so we toast our ancestors. We want to remember all those people that made it possible for us to be here. We want to remember all those people who had, who had faith in us. We want to remember all those people that changed our diapers. We want to remember all those people that fed us when we couldn't feed ourselves. We want, to, we want, we want to toast all those people who carried us when we couldn't carry ourselves. See, you being silly, you wasting it, right? Lift it up. Lift it up. We're gonna toast. Now you go and say the name you wanted to say. Uh, pea pie. It's pea pie. So we toast pea pie. I mm. have a name. Go ahead. So what's the name? Daddy. Daddy father. Oh, daddy father. So we're going to toast Cecil Ellis. All right. Any others? So we're going to toast our grandmothers, our grandfathers. We're going to toast our aunts and our uncles. We're going to toast our cousins. Right? They know who they are. We can say their names, but we're going to... We, we, we did the water. That, that nasty water took up a lot of time. So we're going to toast them and we say... From there, we move to we move to the present moment. Today is a money, great money to y'all. So we're gonna toast this day, this moment, because this is all we have. We toast it and we say, I say. From there, last one. Let's lift the glass up, little girl. Lift the glass up. <laughs> I'm not little I'm big. Okay, cool. Uh last but not least, we're gonna toast our children, our children's children on to infinity. Because if not we for our children. Here. You know what I'm saying? Our children are a treasure. You know what I'm saying? And they are the future. So, we got to toast them and we say, I say. Now, last but not least, some of y'all got some special things out there that y'all need toasted. Some of y'all got some suffering going on. Some of y'all got need some blessings. So, we asking our ancestors to go out in front of us and to make sure we get everything that we need. We toast and we say, I say. I say. I say. Here, come on. Come on. All right. We wish you peace, power, joy, and 100 years. All right? Don't drink up. Mm-hmm. Grown folk. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, is it that good girl? Go on, do it again. I'm going to make that a commercial. Oh, man. Wait, hold on. Get it in the camera and do that again, girl. Let me see that. Ah, uh, okay. Where you learning that at? Sour. Yeah, very sour. That's why I call it the grown folk version. What? All, almost all of oh, the honey is grown oh. on this, y'all. Me too. I'm out. <sighs> Don't come back. All right, peace, Facebook. All right, YouTube is just us now. So the toast is over. We're trying to do jump rope. You can't do jump rope while I'm taping. Get out of here. Yeah. Mm. 
So right now, we are on the mining. Now, yesterday, we talked about the impossible dream. Now, what makes the impossible dream possible? What makes the impossible dream possible is the faith in yourself. The faith in us. Right? Now, so now, I just laid out one of my many of the ideas that I have. I got to give me some ginseng this morning, too. And it's not, you know what I'm saying? It's not, it's other ideas out there. It's other ideas out there, right? And I suggest, I suggest that people start sharing some of their ideas because like I said now, because I want y'all to understand, the reason I'm talking about the geometry complex, it don't have to be called the geometry complex, that's that's just the, the form it took in my mind, right? But we talk about community constantly, but we don't have one. It becomes community when the people that are in the community own it. And when you own it, that gives you power. You know what I'm saying? In a sense, that's a superpower. That's one of the superpowers of being an American. You are able to own the land, right? When you own the land, of course you know, according to the definition of a nation, uh, that is, is a stable, historically developed community of people with territory. Now, from the territory come the economic life, okay? From the territory come the economic life. Once we have a community... That produces economic life. How does it produce economic life? Whether the people are working within the community or outside the community, they're bringing money in. If the community as a group can um, start inspiring young people, inspiring people within the community to start setting up businesses, then the community will start generating business. Now, what people have to understand is that they have to pay taxes to the community. Now, a lot of us don't want to pay taxes, and I understand, right? But we pay taxes to the government, and then we complain about not receiving the services that we need from the government. So in some form or fashion, we have to be able to raise money from the people. When we bring people together in the community, it gives us, it gives us the ability to tax them. Why? Because we need the roads fixed. We need the buildings maintained, right? So... When we when I'm talking when I'm talking Giami and I'm talking culture building and or as I was talking nation building and all this, I'm I gotta build I gotta develop the culture first. I gotta get people to understand that we have to invest in ourselves. We have to believe in ourselves and feel ourselves valuable enough to be able to to really start paying ourselves. We cannot continue. We cannot continue doing some of the stuff that we're doing. Right? We're giving everybody else our money. Right? So if you have a community, like I said, like I live in a complex. If you have a complex, what's to stop you from putting a store right in the center of the complex? What's to stop you from putting a barbershop right in the center of that complex? What's to stop you from doing all that stuff other than you? Other than you as a group. When the group own it, you can go on and rent that property to somebody. That generates money. As they start making more money, that value, that property becomes more valuable. As that property becomes more valuable, then the community can charge more for the rent to use the space. Right? You can have a fresh food co-op right in the middle of that place. Right? You can have a school right there in the place. You can charge money for the school. You can open up the school to the outside people. You can keep the school private. Either way, income coming in. Right then, on top of that, you have everybody pay, uh, um, like they got fees for condos, a condo fee, along with the uh, with the other fees. Condo fee is nothing but a tax, right? But this only happens when we believe in ourselves. I believe in you. I believe in me. I believe in my family. I believe that we could do something like this because we're already living like this in an apartment complex. And many of y'all listening to me right now are living like this in an apartment complex. What I'm saying is, why not control the apartment complex? Why not be part of the government of the apartment complex? Why not be part of the management of the apartment complex? And this is even crazier, right? We can set up, because one of the things I want to set up, I want to set up a real playground, right? Not just for kids, but for adults, right? So the adults can get in shape. See, because these gyms are going out. 
What's coming in now is going to be fun fitness. What's fun fitness? Where individuals are out doing stuff that we used to be able to do when we was younger out in the woods. Balance beams, climbing, jumping, wrestling, running, having fun. And kids and adults can get up on it. All right, uh, you know that's just that's just one of the one that's one of the pieces, right? Now, the the other piece of that, I think that's it. I think that's it. But the key piece is having that money, having that faith, right? Being able to get with a group of people because I got my cheat sheet. Being able to get with a group of people and have harmony within that group, to have trust within that group, so that we can start building, man. It is. It, it is just that simple, right? And it and it that all comes from the culture. Now, one of the things I want to remind y'all about real quick is I'm gonna go, but we got some comments on the videos. Let's check out the comments on the videos. GM girls. Oh, Giami girls. Uh all right, y'all got all right. Sorry. Mm, mm, mm. Man, alright, so now let's go. I want to remind y'all because we are we are in we are into the oils. I want to remind you of the benefits of the oils, right? So first we will go. Um uh, I think tomorrow we're gonna talk about the steamers. Okay? Um so the oils right now we got this one. So I want y'all to remember the benefits of this one. Health benefits, reduce risk of muscular degeneration, which is something that's running. Daddy. You know what I'm saying? That's running through our community. Yes. Helps improve energy levels in the body. Daddy, forgot to do this. Can you wait, please? Helps improve energy levels in the body. Beneficial prevention of cancer. Boosts hormonal, ba hormonal ba balance. Alleviates strain on cardiovascular system. And prevents vitamin deficiencies. All right, in in pregnant women and children. So this is a good one that you can take for yourself as well as take with your children. Okay. Is it bad? No, it's not bad. It's sour. No, it's not. It's not sour. It's a different taste. You eat it when your mom cook for you, cause mm. she uses a lot of. But this this is not the spicy one. I don't think. It's yeah. not spicy at all. But it helps with vitamin deficiencies. Ah, uh, again. You want some more? Uh-huh. All right. And it's high in beta carotene, which is also good. That's why it fights macular degeneration. It also helps the body as far as energy because it don't have to go through all the processes that a lot of... It's sort of again. like the coconut oil. Now, that's enough. Me too, again. It's so weird. This one mine. Can I have one more taste? Mm -mm. You mm -mm. see two drops? We got two drops. Alright. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. That's good. So, That's good. now, Let's the oil, once out. again, is affordable. Y'all can afford this. And also, make sure you get it because you're gonna, you can look it up online, right? But most of the ones that they're going to offer online is not from an African company. You can support an African company by purchasing this, right? So make sure you get it. The one I'm using right now is Nina. Nina but it's another one that I'm going to get. Oh, my daughter going to throw up the black seed oil. <coughs> no, I'm not. All right. So, but before we do the black seed oil, because, you know, that has, that has a lot of benefits, we're going to go to the coconut oil. Yeah. Yes, you can have some. Hold on. Are we supposed to swallow it this time? All right. Are we supposed to swallow it? Yeah, yeah. This one, this time, you you, you swallow it. All right. Sour. So, coconut oil. I just want to remind you. Proven Alzheimer disease natural treatment prevents heart disease and high blood pressure. Cures UTI, kidney infection, and protects the liver. Reduces inflammation, arthritis. Cancer prevention, we ain't gonna go through all. Let's just do this. Here we go. It's easier to digest. 
not really stored as fat. Uh, it's antimicrobial and antifungal, smaller in size, allowing easier cell permeability for immediate Why energy. Black and I think black. it's a natural light. It's uh, processed by the liver, which means they are immediately converted to energy instead of being stored as fat. Right, so it's anti it's antimicrobial yeah, and antifungal, right? Which means no, this is why it so works much. when you when you gargle it in your mouth because it it kills all of those uh, bacteria that might be causing cavities, right? It's also a quick source of energy. All right, let's look at some more stuff that it might do. I, I should go through it. Cancer prevention, immune system boost. Improves memory and brain function, improves energy and endurance, improves digestion, reduces stomach ulcers and ulceritis, uh, reduces symptoms of gallbladder disease and pancreatitis, improves skin issues, prevents gum tissue, stop talking please, and tooth decay, prevents osteoporosis, improves type 2 diabetes, coconut oil for weight loss, excuse me, excuse me. Excuse me. Okay. All right. Building muscle and losing body fat. Coconut oil benefits for hair care. Candida and yeast infections. Coconut oil for anti-aging. Coconut oil for hormonal balance. So it treats all timers here. It's just just list. You can look it up on the internet. But the piece I wanted to make sure I reminded y'all about the the power of these oils that we take. All right. So. And both of them fit into your mouth. The Af yeah, they fit to your mouth, but it fits into the whole African heritage diet thing. Well, first, 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 up down here. First, me, Daddy. Get two. No, you are gonna swallow this one. We ain't oil letting. You gonna swallow it? Can I have some more? And this is also good on food. See what I go through, family. Y'all see this? It's yummy. Give me more. More, please. All right, y'all gone. We love this show. How can we get to go? Now we're gonna start with this oil. Oh, I ain't getting none of that. What? It's sour. Mm mm. Mm mm. It's not for kids. Give me more. No, thank you. Me. For me, more for me, Daddy. Mm -mm. This right. is my time. That's the bomb. Bomb, 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 bomb. Jump with that. All right. So here we go. Are you using the tablet? Yeah, yeah, y'all can take the tablet. I'm done. All right. Last one is that essential black seed oil, essential fatty acids. Right? Steroids and more. Now. Fatty acids. It says essential. Essential means that you need them. Right? And a lot of these essential oils, your body does not produce them. So in these oils, not just this black seed, but in these oils that I'm sharing with you, are essential fatty acids that your body needs. Right? Now, and it's crazy how we allow them to kind of make fats our enemies for a long time. Essential fatty acids, sterols, and more. Highly aromatic, natural antioxidant, which means they catch those free radicals. Natural omega-3, 6, and 9. And this is one of the only oils from the plant kingdom that, that I think make uh, omega-3s. I'm not sure. I got to go and do some more research on that. But we're going to be doing our research, fam. And y'all need to be sharing some of the stuff y'all get. Don't. Don't just be having this be a one-way conversation, man. Oh, by the way, I think it's uh, Vern Love's been dropping her knowledge on here. Um, um, uh, another dude, a couple of other people. I want to thank those people that's been dropping their information on here and letting people know because this is the issue, right? I'm going to make mistakes. I'm going to run up against stuff. Some of the research I might do might be leading me in the wrong direction, and I need your help. 
because this is a show for us by us, right? So if you have comments or you have information, like um, somebody told me about bentonite clay, right? Because, you know, I still do like to take hot baths. And they said to help me with the hot baths, it would be good to put some bentonite clay in it. Uh, I think it's uh, Native Help One. They, they posted it up on the timeline. But the issue is, y'all got to stay busy in the community, in our little community down here. Go below, check the comments. You can put your comments in there so we all can learn together, right? Let's build. I'm not claiming to be no expert. I don't know it all, right? I know a little, right? And I shared a little bit that I have, and I'm bold enough to try new things. But I need some of you who have been in practice and doing some of this stuff to share with the people that's on here. Because maybe you might have a secret that we all need, right? So stop holding your high your life. So let's go and take us a teaspoon of this, this precious, precious oil. I gotta be, cause you know it costs. This one costs a lot of money, and I'm on a budget. Ah, y'all see cool cat clean, right? See, one day my daughter's gonna be chill like this. This really? clean used to be. Really, okay. Daddy? Yeah. We, we really? Really? Re yeah, really. One day my daughters will be chill like this. No, we right. don't. Which one? What, which one what? Oh, you need to get off mine. Hold on, baby. What's this? Uh -uh. Ours won't work. What you mean yours won't work? Our Netflix won't work. Oh, well, you, 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 you bad screwed. news. Yeah, bad news. It's not fair. Um. It's this tablet. No, it's not. It's a You got to take them off your stuff, fam. All right, so the show is almost under 30 minutes. I'm going to thank you. And remember, y'all, all this stuff start by us having trust in ourselves, having trust in the process, faith in us, faith in the process. So let's build, family, all right? Um, Netflix work on the black one. All right, so this is Brother Hot Tim. And I'm saying peace. So now, some of y'all, listen, I'm so excited because some of y'all will be starting the Nguza Saba Challenge next week. If you are starting the Nguza Saba Challenge, you should be getting all your stuff coming to you right now. And I'm wishing you peace, power, peace, power, joy, and 100 years. If you need any help, feel free to let me know, right? I'm so excited for you, right? So, so I'll see you tomorrow morning for the morning toast. Let's get it started. Start it in strength. Let's start it in power. You know what I'm saying? Start it in peace. And let's bring across in your life what you want. And some of you that are hungry, because some of y'all in y'all second, maybe even third week of the Nguza Saba Challenge, right? I hope that you're ready. Some of y'all are going to be ready saying, Brother Hatim, this is not deep enough, right? Now, I sent out the Ashe breath, but that was part one, family. Got a part two for you. It's coming. It's coming and it will change your life. Then on top of that, I have. I'm going to do a more in-depth, let you see how to do the Giami salutation. So I gotta just get somebody who gonna have some time to film it, right? So that you can see how, how to do it. Because like for example, when you do, when you do the very first move, the underlayer, there's a certain way you got to be, right? You know, so stretching out because you can stand still, you can stand still and do stuff, right? And it still be stretching the body. All right. So this is Brother High Tim drinking on this ginseng old school ambrosia. And I'm out. Where's the black tablet, please? Peace, power. Joy in 100 years. See some of y'all because y'all starting your whole thing. Y'all, um, I'm excited for you. Peace. Thank you for watching the video. I want you to subscribe. Click the bird right there. The fiery bird. And I also have a special video just for you. Right there. And for those that want more information about Jeremy Journey, go to our site. It should be right about there.